What would you think if I told you that your front door could recognize you by reading the unique pattern of veins inside the palm of your hand? And what if that same technology could unlock your door in less than three tenths of a second? Well, today we're diving into the TCL D2 Pro Palm Vein Smart Lock, and I'm going to show you why this might be the most secure way to protect your home. In this video, we're exploring what might be the future of home security. The TCL D2 Pro uses palm vein recognition technology that's been around in high security applications for years, but now it's available on your front door. And this isn't just another smart lock with a fancy gimmick. We're talking about biometric security that's virtually impossible to hack, spoof, or steal. Your palm vein pattern is hidden beneath your skin, making it exponentially more secure than fingerprints or even facial recognition. So how does this actually work? Well, the TCL D2 Pro uses infrared light to map the unique vein patterns inside your palm. These patterns are completely unique to you, and here's the key part, they're beneath your skin. Unlike fingerprints, which can be lifted, copied, or even damaged by cuts and scrapes, your palm veins are protected by your skin and remain consistent throughout your life. You can't lose them, you can't forget them somewhere, and nobody can steal them by lifting your prints off of a surface. And this is where things get really interesting from a security standpoint. Traditional smart locks depend on codes, cards, or surface level biometrics. But palm vein recognition requires you to be physically present with your actual hand. Basically, there's no way to spoof the unique vein pattern in your palm. And the TCL D2 Pro keeps all of your biometric data stored locally on the device so it never leaves your home. Now, TCL markets this as a DIY solution. And from what I can tell, they're not kidding. It's designed to fit most standard US doors and can replace your existing deadbolt setup. I'm not going to go through the full installation here since TCL has a comprehensive installation video on their YouTube channel. The whole process took me about 15 minutes by following their installation guide. So if you're comfortable with basic home improvement tasks, this should be a piece of cake. All right, so now for the fun part. I've got the lock fully set up and programmed, and I want to show you all six ways you can unlock this thing. We've got palm vein recognition, the numeric keypad, key fobs, the mobile app, pin codes for guests, and yes, it still works with traditional physical keys as a backup. Let me show you just how fast the palm vein recognition really is. Okay, so here our door is locked and I've got this configured so that I have to manually touch the lock to activate it. Then I can hold my hand up and just like that, it read my palm and the door is unlocked. The speed is pretty impressive, but I know what you're thinking. What happens if your hands are wet or dirty or you've got an injury? Look, I've tested this with damp and dirty hands and it still works reliably. The infrared scanning can penetrate through light moisture and even some dirt. For injuries, as long as the vein pattern in your palm isn't significantly altered, you should be fine. And remember, you've got five other ways to get in if needed. And of course, another question is, well, what about power outages? Well, the D2 Pro has a massive 10,000 milliamp hour rechargeable battery that lasts up to six months on a single charge. And when it does need charging, you get plenty of advanced warning through the app. And this isn't just a standalone device. The D2 Pro integrates with both Alexa and Google Home so you can unlock your door with voice commands when you're inside. The TCL Home app gives you complete control over access codes, timing restrictions, and even sends notifications when family members arrive home. Speaking of the app, you can create temporary access codes for visitors, delivery drivers, or house sitters, and set exactly when those codes are active. One thing that I really appreciate about this lock is its weather rating. It's IP55 waterproof and rated to work in temperatures from negative 13 degrees to 158 degrees Fahrenheit. And living in Colorado, I need something that's going to work reliably year round. The build quality feels solid too. The exterior unit has a nice weight to it and all the materials feel like they're built to last. There's even an integrated doorbell chime so you don't need a separate doorbell system. And here's the thing that really sets this apart the 99.99% recognition rate across all age groups. That's not always the case with biometric systems, but palm vein recognition seems to be much more consistent across different demographics. In today's world, privacy is a huge concern and TCL has addressed this head on. All biometric data stays on the device itself. 
Nothing gets uploaded to the cloud, nothing gets shared with third parties, and the system is fully compliant with CCPA data protection regulations. This local storage approach means that your most sensitive data, your biometric information, never leaves your home, and that's exactly how it should be. The D2 Pro represents a pretty significant step forward in home security technology. The combination of speed, security, and convenience is impressive, and the multiple unlock methods means you're never locked out of your own home. Is it perfect? Well, no smart lock is. But if you're looking for the highest level of biometric security available for residential use, the palm vein technology is proven, the implementation is solid, and the additional features make it a comprehensive smart home solution. If you wanna learn more about the TCL D2 Pro, including current pricing and availability, check out the links in the video description. They've also got detailed installation videos and setup guides on their YouTube channel that'll walk you through everything step by step. But with that said, I wanna thank you guys for spending a few minutes of your day with me here today. I wanna to thank TCL for letting me take a look at the D2 Pro and I'll talk to you in the next one.